Almost two weeks after a fire destroyed their business, the couple who own Edgewood Auto and Tire say they are still open for business. CBS News reporter Mugo Digwe explains why they say they owe a lot of thank yous to the Edgewood community. The smoke and flames are all gone, but the aftermath of the fire is difficult to ignore. In fact, as you can see, the building is a total loss, but the owners tell me they plan to rebuild. Sometimes it takes tragedy to realize just how much a community cares. The community support has helped us a lot and kept us motivated and kept us on track with everything. On the morning of February 6th, while Tracy and her husband were on vacation, their business of almost eight years burned down. Since then, the Edgewood community rallied behind them to help keep Edgewood Auto and Tire going. We've had lots of offers. Um, the one, we just basically took the ones up that we felt were a little bit more feasible to our business. Offers of storage space from numerous businesses like Edgewood Feed Mill. Uh, we took our truck shed and emptied it out and they are able to use that for a repair shop for semis at our location. He says one good turn deserves another. Where they're a big part of us, they help us keep running every day and just for them to be up in business is a big deal for us in the community. And while the cause of the fire or even damage estimates are still unknown, Tracy sees all this support as motivation to one day rebuild. If it had to happen, um, this is probably the best place for it to happen because the support and the customers and everybody has just been overwhelming. Right now, the hope is to start the cleanup process on March 2nd and hopefully begin the rebuilding process right after. In Edgewood, Mugo Digwe, CBS 2 News.